Good morning, folks. We have several items to hit today. Observer Review comes out tonight. We have two excellent papers to cover as well, but the big story is going on this morning at our star. Let's begin by looking back at the Enlil Spiral. Both NOAA's and NASA's CME trackers have the filament eruption from two days ago set to impact Earth tonight. It's not a massive impact or a direct hit, but a glancing blow is expected. Low to moderate geomagnetic activity is probable. But the bigger story is what has happened the last day. Several solar flares erupted from the active regions and that massive plasma filament has released this morning. We can see here that a good portion of the eruption is likely heading out to the right ahead of Earth's orbit, but it will be important today to monitor the coronagraph images to make sure there isn't an Earth-directed component. There may very well be. Given the size of the filament, I am envisioning a pretty wide burst of plasma ejected, so that will be the focus for the analysis that we'll be doing throughout the day today. First article is one on the Malaysian power grid resiliency to solar storms, or rather, the lack thereof. We've seen similar studies performed around the world, but this is a first for this region. However, just like the others, the result is that a major solar storm is going to cause major trouble for the power infrastructure of the area. The other article today, it comes as a solid confirmation of the levels of water in Mars' atmosphere being directly tied to solar activity. This is key because it occurs in a similar way to how the sun impacts water in Earth's atmosphere. If these processes work on Mars, they certainly work here as well. Indirect confirmation of solar forcing of the weather. Folks, if you'll be in Colorado Springs next weekend, we'd love to see you. Family-friendly event, networking, and see if you can throw an axe better than I can. We also have this month's issue of Observer Review coming out tonight. This monthly e-magazine covers the top stories of the last month and is currently the number one way to support the observers. We greatly appreciate your support, by the way. Links are found below the video. We'll do this all again tomorrow right here but right now it's 5 a.m in the new valley of the sun eyes open no fear be safe everyone